Hi, this is Christopher Wook from Android Authority, and we're here with a review of the Samsung Galaxy Rugby Pro. While it may not be top of the line spec-wise, it's not really meant to be. The main advantage of this phone is that it's built like a tank. The Galaxy Rugby Pro will cost you $99 with a two-year contract from AT&T and $449 without a commitment. Looking at the specs, the Samsung Galaxy Rugby Pro has a 4-inch WVGA Super AMOLED display with a resolution of 480 by 800 and 16 million colors. It runs a Qualcomm Snapdragon S4 Plus chipset with a 1.5 GHz dual-core processor and 1 GB of RAM. Internal storage is 8 gigs, expandable up to 32 gigs via the micro SD slot. The phone is powered by a 1850 milliamp hour battery rated for up to 11 hours of talk time and 336 hours of standby time. Looking at the build quality, it's easy to see that the Samsung Galaxy Rugby Pro is very ruggedly built. It's water, dust, and shockproof to military specifications, and while we couldn't test this because Samsung would get mad at us, it looks like it could survive a drop on a concrete floor without any problems at all. The phone has a big, chunky feel to it, but despite this, it's surprisingly light, weighing in at just 4.6 ounces. On the front of the phone, we find hardware home, menu, and back buttons below the screen, and the 1.3 megapixel front-facing camera above it. On the left side, we see the volume rocker and a user-customizable button right above it. On top of the phone, there is a covered 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, while the right side is where we'll find the power button. The bottom of the phone has a covered micro USB port. Finally, on the back of the phone, we find the 5 megapixel rear camera, the flash, and the speaker. Below this, you'll notice this little lock. You'll need a coin to unlock this, and beneath it is where the battery, SIM card, and micro SD slot are located. The Samsung Galaxy Rugby Pro runs Android 4.0.4 Ice Cream Sandwich with Samsung's TouchWiz UI running on top of it. So far, there is no word on whether or not the Rugby will see an update to Jelly Bean. Every once in a while, the phone's somewhat lower specs become apparent when you're scrolling through the home screens, but performance is generally good. There are a lot of apps included, and some are more useful than others. For example, users might find S Voice useful but not AT&T Navigator, especially since Google Maps is included already. Unfortunately, users who don't want these apps will find that they can disable them, but can't actually uninstall them. The quality of the Galaxy Rugby Pro's 5 megapixel camera is good for the most part, and pictures are sharp, but you may find that the colors are a little washed out in certain pictures. The phone is capable of capturing 1080p video, which looks fairly crisp, but does have the same issues with washed out colors that photos taken with the phone have. The Samsung Galaxy Rugby Pro's 4G LTE works very well. The connection was always fast, even in areas with low signal, and web browsing seemed at least as fast as Wi-Fi, if not faster in some cases. Call quality was also fine. It was neither dramatically better or worse than we expected. To wrap up, while performance did have to take a bit of a hit in order to make the phone so tough, it's surprisingly fast and should perform well as long as you don't need the absolute highest specs available. While the chunky body and buttons won't appeal to everyone, the phone is by no means ugly either. The Samsung Galaxy Rugby Pro might not wow you with its specs, but it's a great phone for anyone whose line of work, for example, frequently puts them in situations where a normal smartphone might be just a bit too delicate. If you're unusually clumsy, this could also be a great phone for you. Have you used a Samsung Galaxy Rugby Pro yet? Do you plan on buying this phone, or do you know anyone you think it would be useful for? Let us know what you think. This has been Christopher Wook for Android Authority. Please let us know what you think of this video as well as the other videos on our channel. Thanks.